What's up, guys? What's going on? We're playing Hogwarts Legacy today. Just came out. Yeah, I just uh, got started here. Now, apparently I'm a Hufflepuff, according to my Harry Potter fan club account, whatever. But um, I don't know if this is going to use that stuff already or if it's going to allow me to do a whole new thing. So we'll see. Um, but as you can see, yeah, Hogwarts Witchcraft, School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Professor Weasley. Mm. Oh, okay, here we go, character creation. So this is exactly what we're going to be spending quite a bit of time on. Because I definitely want to get my character to look like me. Um, okay. There is some black boy joy here. I would say out of all of these, this one looks like me the most right now. Uh, no, maybe. Nah. At least... It, so now we can adjust this one, right? So we want to adjust all of this right now. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna save this one for now. All right. Oh no. I'm not that dark, but. I'll see this one. Yeah. Mm hmm. More detail with the face shape. I don't think I want glasses. <laughs> mm. They got a lot of hairstyles, but I I mean, I I I guess they don't have modern black hairstyles in the 1800s so I mean my hair was basically like this a couple of weeks ago I just cut it off so I guess I will go with that yeah that's not my hair well actually my hair was more like this now that I think about it <laughs> Yeah, my hair was more like this about a week ago, so we're going to keep that. Um, I look a little red. I don't know why I look so red. There we go. That looks better. Um, yeah, no, we'll stick with that. Okay. And my hair was also blonde, which was pretty funny. 
So let's see. My hair was like bleached. Pretty much like that. Let's just see if I see a color that was closer to the one that I had. Nah. I feel like it's the same it's the same color as his skin. And the black looks good, but it's boring. Okay, we'll do that. Are we gonna mark him up? Is he gonna have this, this scar? To get mauled by a bear. That looks crazy. That looks like somebody branded him. I said we keep that one. It's not too crazy, but it's it's still like bam. You're not missing that. This one. Oh, it kind of splits off. It's like a Y. We got eyebrows, we got eye color, eyebrow. Really, I, I thought it was gonna be a little more customizable. So you can only pick from these templates, hmm. That's a little disappointing. I thought it was gonna be like Elden Ring where you could uh, actually like customize it and make it look like you interesting so you literally have to choose between <laughs> black number one black number two black number three and that's it you got a lot of Asian looking people which is fine
They don't even let you customize your eyes. I'm really surprised. Unless I missed something. No. Do I want freckles and markings? He's got a couple of moles there. Sure, let's give him freckles. Okay, well there's the eye color, I missed that. Some of these eye colors look scary. This really looks good though, but I was really, I'm really surprised that you can't, um, I'm really surprised that you can't really, uh, make it look like, look more like you. I could have sworn that it, they made it seem like it was more customizable. That's fine. What are you gonna do? Do make you in a brow? <laughs> nah. Oh, they have a little little cuts. That's dope. Ah, uh, he looks a little more endearing there. I want him to look like, I want him to look like he's like half werewolf or something. We'll play on normal. Okay. Well, they let me name him. I mean, I don't see the point of letting you pick between witch or wizard, because I guarantee you, if I pick witch, it's going to change his sex. So, why would they even do that? Why would they even put this choice here? Anyway. And you get I'm one... Eager to get the Hogsmeade. That sounds like freaking Daniel Radcliffe. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. That was quite something. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Yeah, he doesn't sound like that. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Yeah, why does it I, sound... It was wonderful. I, I'm eager to get to Hog... I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. That was quite something. And why is the other... It was wonderful. I, a few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. That was quite something. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really... I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Why does it sound like that? That was quite something. Like, you can clearly hear it's going through some oscillator. Like, it sounds very harsh. Like, it makes you just want to pick the normal voice. It was wonderful. Look at I that. I'm really going to enjoy this class. That sounds like it's like a cartoon. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Mmm. What should I name this feller? Jackson. Wilder, I don't know. <laughs> Oh, 
Gotta make his last name Wilder. All right, that's it. Any final changes? Do we want to give him the glasses? No. He doesn't need glasses. Be cool with the hairstyle. Be cool with the little scar here. Let's start the journey. I wanted to make him fat. <laughs> I wanted to make him fat. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well. I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. No, not when that I received loud. Your owl, I must uh, say I best not speak here, Eliasar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. He does not look like how he sounds, but all the other cousin. voices sounded like good to see the old they were going through the these rocks. unnatural filters. It sounded really bad. It's almost as if it forces you to do that. That's so weird. I wonder if those are being carried by pestles. Hey. In true Harry Potter fashion, you go right through the, the, the symbol. Companion. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years, need a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? Goblin Rebellion Truth or Gobbledygook? Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? 
She wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you? Oh. We do. That is so weird. Oh, he just saw that guy die. That is crazy. That is crazy. So he just saw a dude die. And in and, 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 and between that time he like it was instant. The pestrels like you could see them. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Oh, so you want me to press down to heal. Covered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Wow, it's this is looking beautiful. Look at the grass. This looks crazy. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those roads. Do you think the port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Yeah, you trying to get me killed, sir. My guy. Get 
camera's good. Where do you suppose your wife got the pool key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Wow. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic I don't know where she came into possession of the port key but I am certain it was to do with that search ah there's the path down below this way okay I hope you know where you're going but sir why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the, the one person. who wields yeah. it. Uh. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Tap R2 to perform a basic spell cast. All right. than I'd expected. Oh, so it's when it's white like that, it's selected. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Pretty windy. I feel like Repero is such like a generic ass name for a spell to repair things. But I mean, I guess that's the same spell that was used in the first movie. But she. She had to say his glasses first. She said Oculus, right? Oculus repair. This is the way I'm about to fight somebody. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That porky led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Manual shows the surrounding, the middle. 
set the toggle objective details. Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? <laughs> Professor Fig! Oh shit, you scared the crap out of me. Someone have conjured that enchanted stone here. And how is there a room behind it? What room? That's what it, I don't see. Oh, anything. he can't see it. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. Oh, they got teleported again. Where are we? I don't believe it. Wait, you hear something sleeping. Oh, wake up goblin. Hello? I knew it was the bank. I knew it was the bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key? Mm -hmm. Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Wow. He was about to give him up. Look at the bottom, the bottom is just open, they could just fall. <laughs> Are they about to go to the water? That waterfall washes away all in charge. Oh. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. So it's all the way to the bottom. The deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. That was cool. Vault number. Vault 12. 
Momentous day! <laughs> hmm. On your way. <laughs> he looks extra cautious. He knows something ain't right with that one. Dragon's collar. Yeah, was that? We were just wondering about that goblin. The he watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Vault was accessed. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Wow. I'm getting a bad feeling. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key Ooh. and then close the door. Ooh. I knew that was going to happen. I knew that was going to happen. Professor? was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Okay, steady your wand and with L, guide it along the symbols path to learn the spell. Press the correcting the corresponding input button through. Okay. When prompted to accelerate your wand's motion. Oh, I didn't realize what to do that game. Okay. Cool. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Oh. Lumos. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do, but to what end I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Disapparating? See something up ahead. What is it? That glow again. 
but on the floor. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. What's that? You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Okay, that's a sword. There must be something to that reflection you're seeing. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. All right, I'm learning these spells. Learning these spells. You require the wine light charm the most when, which is automatically been slotted to your spell slot. We must create like typical one. See in the dark areas. So I gotta hold R two and then try and Lumos. Get well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. <laughs> Oh, we got a fight. Look out! Protect it! Accio! Defendo! Let me use her! Depose her! How did he get so close? You objected to reel the way forward, okay. I couldn't see that, bro. Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? Oh shit. This isn't good. Where oh shit, he disappeared. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. where they're leading me. That glow again. Lumos. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. I 
I need to align these statues with their reflections. Hmm. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. That wasn't hard. Hold, hold triangle during particular stun enemies with a stupefy counterattack. Okay. Yo, this is scary, bro. This is, oh my God. Mm -mm. I don't like that red. Lumos. This is this is this is like Dark Souls when you about to get into the boss fight. Am I back at the bank? What is going on here? That looks like what you came here for. Uh, See? How did you? What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Looks like there's one memory in there. Follow my lead. too well I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow it will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough Percival we are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets with knowledge others will do 
anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, Percival the Rackham. wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And wow. you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give bygones be bygones. What? Fuck <laughs> uh, Sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I, I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have oh. it. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. <laughs> Oh god. Look what you done did now. Oh god. Now you got the sentinels coming out here for you. Come on, man. Oh. oh. Are they back where they started? Or are they are in some right? random ass forest? Fine, sir. I've never oh. seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. Hogwarts. It's oh, the, the, the dark forest. The, the locket and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Cue title screen. Oh, 
that was a great opening. That was a great first couple of minutes of the game. Oh yeah. All right, well. Looks like I've been doing for an hour now. Well, uh, this is going to take a little bit to complete probably, but I think we'll continue another time. This is fun though. Alrighty, well, see you on next time. See you on the next one.